In this tutorial, we're going to cover the delete face tool here, and later on, we're going back to the freeform and road surface tools. So let's activate the delete face, and from its name, you are able to delete some surfaces. So let's select that surface. You have three different options. The simplest one is the delete. Sometimes, according to the geometry, you are not able to select the rest. So let's select the delete. And here, when you are selecting that face, it gives you some option what to delete with it. So all surrounding, all outer, and so on. So let's select that. Then you are selecting that face. Okay. So let's try to make it on this. Activate the delete. Select that one. Delete. Let's select delete and fill. It's not going to work because you need to select some more, some more faces. So delete it and fill it at the same time. So it has no result. So let's try on that. then okay so again it has no result because it filled with the same surface so we can do is delete and fill select and select the old tangency okay you'll notice the change in here now Let's try to delete this single surface. If you try to delete it with this delete face, select that face, delete, it's not going to work. So you need to, do, say, to make another option to delete that single face. Go to the insert feature, delete body, select that face, okay. So the delete phase is having some options to delete some loops and so on. But in case of single phase, you can choose delete or from features delete body. So if you select that, it's going to select all the surrounding. If you select that, select selection and select that space then you are able to delete that surface 